Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, it's going to be an exciting but sad one as well. My favorite store in the world is going out of business and they are having a, a huge sale um, because like I said, they are going out of business. They're trying to get rid of everything in the store. So they are up to 40% off right now and I might have done some damage. So I definitely spent um, $300. <laughs> So I just kind of wanted to haul it for you guys. Um, I know, obviously, that every store isn't going to have the same things. Lots of things are probably going to be sold out, so some of the stuff I may be showing you, you may not be able to get. But I did want to let you guys know that they are having a sale. If you're interested, you need to run, not walk. So anyway, actually, I did film a video last week uh, before they announced that they were... Um, closing their store. I did film a video um, talking about mainly shoes. I did a shoe haul and then I had like a few other things, um, but I decided to discard that video. I'm going to include those few things in this haul and then show you what I got in their sale. So we're going to start with those items, like I said. So I did um, get a couple pairs of shoes. So first, these are like my favorite sandals in the world. So I did get these. They are just like some straps across the front and then they have these straps in the back and they have this really cute gold detail on the tops here. I did get mine in a size 9. They're a little bit big but the size 8 is too small and they don't have half sizes there. So I did get these in brown which is my favorite and then I did get them in black as well. They also have the gold detail at the top both of them in a nine. I know these were on sale at the time that I bought them. I think it was like $12 a piece. They're normally like $16. Then I did get these. Um, these shoes were two for 15, I think at the time. So they're these little strappy sandals. So they have the two straps. These are some of like my favorite like slip on sandals. So I did get a pair in brown, also in a size nine. And then I did get these ones, which are probably my favorite because they have snake skin on them. So the top one is just like a nude beige. And then this part is snake skin, which I love snake skin if you didn't know about me. So that's a little fact. I did get two pairs of jeans. Um, so I got these ones which are just black because I needed a new pair of black jeans. Um, their brand that they have is Refuge which they have my favorite jeans and so I don't know what I'm gonna do um, once they go out of business. But I can normally wear either a four or a six. Um, these happened to be in a six and these are their high rise skinny jeans and so they just look like this. They have little holes in the knees and they're super cute and I don't know, I just, I needed a new pair of black jeans and so I thought these ones were perfect and I really do like high-waisted pants. So I picked these ones out and then I got another pair of high-waisted pants which are these ones. They're also um, in a size 6 and they're the same style just in a different color, so like normal jean color. So they have the rips here, here, and then one on the knee on the other side. That is everything that I did get in the first haul. So after that... I have been so distraught because I'm really sad that the store is going out of business, obviously. Um, so I've been on three separate occasions to different um, locations to try to snag everything that I could. So this is from the first location that I went to. I did end up getting two pairs of flip-flops. So I got these white ones because I actually, I realized I don't have any white anything in my um, collection, like any kind of shoes. Um, so I did get these ones because they have the gold little detail on top and I just think that's so cute. Um, these were a size 9 as well. These were originally $8.99 but I think they were on sale for $6. And then I did pick up another pair um, just in black because I thought they were super cute and comfortable and again I just love this little gold bar. So cute. Again, the size 9. And then I did pick up this, which is so, so cute, and I'm super excited to wear it. So it's this little guy right here. I'm not sure that you can see, but it's like a romper, and the little sleeves here are see-through, which are really cute and lacy. It does come down to a V right here, and then like crosses across here. Um, it does have a belt over the waistline. The bottom as well is really cute and they have like built-in shorts to a certain point and then the lace goes even further and it's really cute. And it's not too short um, on me and I really liked it. Um, so originally this was $36.99 and I got it for $8 which is crazy because it's so cute. Um, they only had one left and it was in a medium. And it's a little too big for me, but I will definitely make it work because it was just so super cute and I couldn't pass it up. And then um, in this haul, I did end up just getting a few more things. So I got their scent, their Eau de Toilette. 
um, in the scent Sugared Vanilla, which smells absolutely incredible. This was only originally $7.99, which I thought they were more expensive than that, but it ended up being like $5. And then I did end up getting two pairs of sunglasses um, that were a little bit more out of my comfort zone. I have been trying to expand my sunglass collection just a little bit because I like different colored ones for like certain days or different outfits or like I have my certain ones that I wear when I'm wearing no makeup or ones that are like a dressier, you know, I don't know. Um, so anyway, I just chose two different sunglasses that I thought were a little bit different and that I wouldn't normally pick up, but because they were on sale for like $5, I was fine with it. So the first ones I got were these and they have like a blue tint to them. I'm not really sure if you can see all that well, um, but the top of these and like the frames are rose gold. And then on the back here, they also have um, like the little pink piece back here. And these are just super cute. Um, I'll show you guys what they look like on me. You can definitely see my eyes through them, which is something that I don't typically go for. And they do have a very blue, um, like, tint to them when you're looking at me. But I just thought they were so super cute. And I don't know. They're different for me. And, like, it's a different shape. I don't normally go for this. But I thought they were kind of cute. So, And then the next ones are just, like, a classic black pair. But these are, like, massive. Like, they are so big, like this is what they look like and I just love them. They're just black and huge. Um, so this is what they look like on my face. It is so big, but I kind of love it about it. I felt like very like, this is what I need to wear with my little straw hat on the beach and no cares. Um, I don't know, I just, I really liked these ones and I decided to pick them up too cause like just $5 and who knows. I think they're really cute. Alright, so that was everything for my first trip. And now my second trip is where I spent the most money. So this one was the biggest for sure. So here's the bag that they put this in. Huge. So I ended up picking up this shirt in the store to try on with everything. And I, and I ended up really liking it. And it was only $3 on uh, sale. So I picked it up. It's just a basic t-shirt and like goes down. It kind of does like a little scoop thing situation there. It just, it was really cute and I thought it was white, but it turns out it's actually kind of like got this blue tint to it, which I actually really like about it. Um, but it looks really cute with a lot of the things that I ended up purchasing. So I was like, eh, why not? And then I did end up getting a couple pairs of shorts because they were going out of business. I love their shorts. I needed some more shorts for summer anyway. So I decided to do this and I don't have any black shorts. So I decided to get these. These are high-waisted shorts. They're high-waisted shorty, and it says that they're supposed to make you have a flatter waist, but I don't know about that. Um, I got these in a size 4. They were originally $24.99, but I think I ended up paying $17 for them. I think they were 30% off. So these are just what they look like. They do have the high-waisted here, and then they're just black. Super cute. Then I ended up getting these pair too because, I mean... They were just really cute, and I don't have any color like this either. I know that these are black, technically, but they're like a faded gray. Um, just super cute. They have little rips in them, and then they are high-waisted as well. Um, I also got these in a size 4. And then these ones are so super cute. Um, I love camo, too, and so I decided to get a pair of camo shorts. Um, these are what these ones look like here. On the bottom, they're like frayed and super cute. They have uh, little rips, and they are high-waisted. Uh, but they only have the one button as where the other ones that I just showed you were three buttons. Then I did something that was kind of out of my comfort zone. Um, I'm not really a big skirt person, but I decided to end up getting this one. Um, so this is just a cute little jean skirt, if you can see it there. Just a jean skirt, like normal. It has the one button on the front. Um, just really cute. And I'm not really a jean skirt wearer, but I've always wanted to be. Hopefully I can pull it off. Um, but this was, I got it in a size medium. Um, I don't think a size small would have fit around my bootay, but it is a little too big in the waist, but I can just put on a little belt and it'll be fine. And then I got these, which are something that's also out of my comfort zone, but I'm like really happy I bought them because they're super cute and super comfortable. Um, these are called paper bag shorts. I'm not sure if you've heard of that before. I didn't know what they were until my sister told me, but they're this really cute, like blush pink nudie-ish type color. And they don't have any like buttons or anything. They just like cinch around the waist. Um, so they have a lot of room to grow into and then they tie as well. And they're just so cute and so comfortable. I got another one of those, the romper that I showed you earlier, the black one, I got another one. Um, they had one in this store as well. It was in a size small. 
um, which actually fits way better than the medium does. Uh, but this one is in maroon, which is really pretty. Like I said earlier, it does have the little sleeves that are see-through to a certain point, and then um, the bottom is also like see-through lace, uh, but it does have built-in shorts. Then I purchased some dresses, and this one I was kind of on the fence about just because I wasn't sure if I liked it all that much. Um, I knew I really love the material of it, and I love the sleeves on it, but I wasn't sold on like the boob area of it. But it's a really cute pattern. This is what it looks like. Um, it is a v-neck. It does have these little buttons across and it does have cinching in the waist. You can see it better on the back. Print is really cute. It's like these little, I don't even know what you call it. They almost look like flowers, but I'm not sure that they are. But anyway, this is just really cute. It's like a very nice flowy material. I did get one more dress um, from this shopping trip and this one is definitely very springy to me. It kind of reminds me of an East, Easter dress. Oh, I didn't tell you I got the last dress in a size small. And then this one is the very Eastery one to me. So this is what it looks like. It's very cute and it has on the bottom like this little built-in ruffle thing like that to make it kind of like bigger at the bottom, which is really cute. It's just this really pretty um, florally design. It has these beautiful colors in it. And at the top, don't worry, I just tied the dress really tight. That's not how little it is. <laughs> um, and then at the top, it's just like little spaghetti straps and I don't know, very cute. Um, I did get this one in a size medium because they didn't have any in the size small. It's a little big, but like I can deal with it. Okay, and then I did get a little set of belts. These were originally $7.99, but they were on sale for $5. So I got a set of three belts and the reason I got this one is because there was a snakeskin belt in the pack. So they're like skinnier belts. Here is the snakeskin one. Then they had this one, which was just a cute little brown one with like a western little handle, or handle, little um, belt buckle. I wasn't really into that one, but I think it'll be really cute paired with the right thing. And then this one, which is just like a gray beige colored belt. So I thought all of these were really cute and I especially had to get it because of the snake skin because you know I'm obsessed with snake skin. The first haul that I showed you guys was from when they weren't going out of business. I didn't know they were going out of business and then now this was from when I knew. So I decided to purchase another pair of the strappy sandals, the brown ones with the gold plated stuff because these literally are my favorite sandals. I needed another pair for when my other ones get nasty, you know, because eventually they're going to get nasty. So these are like my backup pair, my one and only backup pair because I don't know what I'll do without these sandals and I know that sounds stupid but I love these sandals so much um so anyway I got these again in a size 9 they were $15.99 originally and they were on sale for $11 I got a lot of underwear from them like everything else literally everything I love is from them um, I really like their underwear because they remind me of pink but they're not too expensive um I think it was always like 6 for 12 or something but all their underwear were on sale for $2.45 so you know your girl grabbed a lot of underwear so that was all for the second trip. Okay, so the third and final haul is just this smaller bag, and there's only two items in here, um, but I did want to share them again. So I had been looking for these pants the whole time at every single place because I've always wanted to buy them, but I never have, and no one had them, and so I was really sad about it, and I was fine, but I was walking back to the dressing room because I had other things to try on, and I saw on the racks of something that people didn't want, I saw this one pair of jeans, and I was like, wait, are those the ones I want? And I go over to them to look, and turns out it was the ones I wanted, and I was like, okay, they have to be in my size or I'm going to cry. <laughs> and I know that sounds dramatic, but, <laughs> but like seriously, I was going to cry. And they ended up being a four. So I snagged those puppies, tried them on, and fell in love. So these are the jeans right here. They are just a gray um, black color with cutouts in the knees, and then on the bottom they have this cute little fraying business. Unfortunately, I am too short. So I do have to roll them up, but they're still very cute. Um, this is in this style skin tight legging and these were $32.99 originally, but they were on sale for $27. And of course I had to buy them because they're just so stinking cute and I don't have any jeans that are like this color in my collection. And then my sister 
forced me to try this on at the store and I'm really glad that she did. This is the last item that I do have to show you guys. This is a romper that I fell in love with and it is so stinking cute. This is what it looks like. It just has a very deep V here which I'll end up wearing something underneath it because it makes me uncomfortable. But it has the like flowiest, prettiest sleeves and they actually like cut at the like elbow point. So like when you move, if you move your arm like up, you can see that part which I thought was really cute. And it cinches at the waist here. Here is the bottom of them. I think they're a little bit lower. This is like awkward, but it's a little bit lower in the back than it is in the front. So it has like a really cute like swoop to it if I turn sideways, you know. And then it just ties in the back up at the neck. And I just thought this was so super cute. It has a really nice feeling to it. This was $29.99 originally and it was on sale for $20 and it's just so stinking cute and I can't wait to wear this. I don't know where but I will. Alright guys so that is everything for my haul. Um, it's really sad haul because they are going out of business which I've said like 30 times in this video but they really honestly are my favorite store and I really am sad about it. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know any finds that you guys have found at Charlotte Russe and if they are your favorite store and I'm just so sad. It was such short notice that they were going out of business and but I did I clearly I spent all my money and got some good finds. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys are having a blessed day or night wherever you are and I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye. That just reminded me of um friends when she's like Hello, my babies. I think it's hello. Goodbye. Goodbye, my babies. Thank you, my babies. It's thank you. It's thank you. I swear. I don't know. My sister went on that. Bye.